Hi, this is Anil. In this video, I will show you how to create Java web service and how to publish that web service and how to write a client that uh, access that web service. In Java, you can uh, follow two approaches to create a web service. One is code first approach and one more is visual first approach. In the code first approach, we will first develop the Java classes and uh, Java compiler or Java web service compiler will create the visual. In the visual first approach, we will uh, create a visual first and Java or Java web service compiler will create the Java classes for us. To create a web service, first you need to create a normal Java project. Cal web service. This web service contains only simple class that contains add method. Cal web service. First, we need to create a Java interface. Cal web service. This interface contains only one method. Call add a text to argument and return integer. To create interface, to make interface as web service, we need to annotate this interface with the web service method web service annotation and you can use soap binding style RPC you can give document also and I'm using RPC here you can directly create the class and annotate with web service annotation but it is better practice to create interface and implement that interface and we'll put this in a package. And this, okay. And create a class, Calab service IMPL, which implements this interface and implement all the methods return x plus y and annotate this class also with at web service annotation and endpoint interfaces com dot dot this interface and annotate so binding style as RPC. Now we have completed our app service that contains only one method called add. Now you want to publish this web service. If you want to publish a web service, we can use any app server, but I'm using a server that comes with JDK 6. To publish the web service, JDK 6 contains one class called endpoint. This class contains publish method that will take a URL where we need to deploy this web service. I'm deploying this in here in this location and we need to give the web service implementation class. Cal app series MPL and we can print that is deployed or not by using this is publish method. It will return true if it is deployed successfully. Now I will uh, run this. Now it is deployed. Now we'll write a class app service client class to access this app service. Cal client. To access app service, first we need to create the visitor location. For that, we'll create URL object. This URL contains visitor location. That once you deploy, you can check whether it is deployed or not using this location. 
we have deployed our uh, app service in this location this location and we need to give question mark on visual it will show the visual for this web service to access the web service first we need to create the URL that contains visual location visual location is this one need to through the exception and we need to create the qualified name that will take target namespace as well as the service name next we need to create the service using the service class service.create this will take the visual location and fully qualified service name it will create service for us After getting the service, we need to get the port, get port of this cal service that is interface name. Also, I need to reference variable. After getting the service port call the method at and print the result now we'll run this class we got the result now I'll summarize what we have done first we need to create uh, interface untied with our web service untied with soap bending implement the class and uh, annotate with web service give the endpoint interface that is this uh, interface and publish on a web server that comes with JDK give the uh, URA of that where we need to deploy and mention the web service implementation class then create a client class first you need to create the visual location URL and web service fully qualified name and pass these two to service class create method get the port and call that service and call that method thanks for watching